Takeaway.com CEO, delisting in the United States, does not indicate a plan to sell Grubhub. Amsterdam, Just Eat Takeaway.com CEO, Jits Grown said on Sunday the company's decision to delist its shares from the Nasdaq stock exchange should not be taken as an indication of plans to sell its Grubhub subsidiary. The company announced its intention to delist its U.S. shares on Tuesday. Shares of the Amsterdam-based company remain listed on the Amsterdam and London stock exchanges. This is a cost reduction measure. Grown told Dutch television program, Business Class, in an interview. He repeated that the company is still considering various strategic options for the subsidiary's future. Takeaway, the largest food delivery company in Canada, Germany, and Britain, bought Grubhub for $7.3 billion in June last year, but has since come under pressure from shareholders https colon slash slash www.reuters.com slash article slash just dash eat dash takeaway dash investor dash i dink bn 2 hf 0 and 8 to sell the unit. In the interview, Grown repeated his conviction that only the largest food delivery players in each market will, eventually, be highly profitable. He acknowledged the company is, not number one, in the US, or it competes with DoorDash and Uber among others. We have to get into a market position such as we have in the Netherlands, so that we can earn money, he said. We have a lot of discussions with people in the US over Grubhub. If you talk to people and you have to have the goal that it improves the business. Takeaway shares closed at 38.25 euros on Friday down 6% on the day. They have lost two-thirds of their value since reaching a peak above 109 euros in October 2020.